So yes people, welcome back to another video here on the JNM Football Channel. So today, the topic I'm going to be talking about is how would you know if you're being scammed by like a fake agent or a fake club? So let's just get straight into the video. So as most of you probably know, I recently got home from professional trials in a different country. And I did go through an agent. Um, but I had to get like an official invite, which is a letter, which is in this piece of plastic, which, which I'm going to like um, talk about, show you guys and how you can tell if it's a scam, if it's legit and real and like any small things you can pick up on. So basically what I've done is I've rewritten the whole letter, which hopefully you'll see now on the screen, missing out any keywords or information that would um, allow you guys to know where I trained. Uh, what club, what country, all that stuff. So hopefully that I've done it well, that you can still see like the important stuff, but you can't see any like important information that would give it away basically. So it's just a simple letter, and as you can see at the start, it just says the name of the club, which obviously I'll just put a line there, football club, and then it just says Mr. Joshua Moles, and it has my passport number on the official letter here, which I've got here. Then it just has the address of the club, and it goes into like the letter, so it says, Dear Josh, professional player trials further to your discussion with the owner mr blah, blah 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 you are warmly invited to attend the line professional player trials and training session for the 2021-22 season the details are outlined below it just says the event start date end date and it says a little bit about that i'm required to make my own travel arrangements and, and that i complied with the rules about covid then it also says that i would get transport and my accommodation sorted by the club and, if, and then if I have any questions or anything, I can just contact them and add the bottom signature, the name of the managing director of the club, and that's it basically. So it's really simple, nothing crazy. So when you're going to a professional club or a club that's legit and they're not a scam or fake, then this is what the um, invitations should sort of look like. So it can be a bit different to this. This is what it's kind of gonna look like, like your name, the address, the start date, end date, um, if you have accommodation, food, if you have to do your own travel, um, and things like this. And then obviously it has contact details, name of who, who you have to contact, and all that stuff. Now, um, with, with, um, with talking to a lot of fake agents and scam artists in the past, and, I, and we've also had players send in invitation letters that they've got from agents that turn out to be fake and a scam. Um, now the first things that you can notice when you've gotten a letter and it's a scam, there's um, spelling mistakes, it doesn't look professional, the print is a bit crap, the wording's weird and off and you can tell it's not proper English or Spanish or whatever um, country you're going to. So there's like small things like that. I, I remember that um, someone, one of our clients who was signed up to our training programs, he got an invitation letter from an agent and just the wording was so off and dodgy and like it didn't even make sense and stuff like that and in the end it did turn out to be a scam but the guy didn't go for it but he turned out from others that it was a scam. So you can, you can tell straight away by the wording, does it make proper sense, does it sound professional, is it formal, because this is a formal letter so it has to be formal, they can't like talk in slang and stuff like that, it has to be formal. Um, so that's another one. Then just like the the print, is it clean, professional, is there a logo of the club logo? Like I think on my letter, there was the logo of the club and UEFA. Now I know anyone can put that on a um, a piece of paper, but it does look um, it does look professional and many people don't think of that. So like the FIFA logo, UEFA logo, the club logo, copyright, all that sort of stuff website, contact details, phone numbers. So yeah, if it, do, if it doesn't have all that stuff, and if the print's like really dodgy, kind of like cheap, doesn't look professional, if any images are like really like full of pixels and they're not clean, then that's another way you can like kind of see that it's not legit. Um, so yeah, basically they're the main ones I would say. Spelling, is it formal? Does it make 100% sense? Is it proper English or Spanish or French or German, whatever? Does it 100% make sense? 
Is it professional? Are there contact details on there? Is there your name, passport number? Does it state anything about accommodation, travel, start date, end date? Does it all match up with what they said beforehand? Does it match up with what the agent says, the club says? All these things that you can tell that like, oh, this might be a scam, this isn't right, things like that. Now, um, not all clubs and agents do have these sort of invitation letters, but me going abroad and because of covid now like it was an important thing because they even asked for it at the airport of like proof one why am i going to this new country i just showed them this and then they can see that i'm going for work so basically that was fine um so yeah like a lot of the time if you're talking to an agent and you don't know if they're real or if they're a scam get them on the phone get them on facetime skype zoom i don't know whatever just get them on get them like one to one if you can't meet in real life in person then get them on the phone zoom zoom is better i'll say than, than just on the phone and just ask some questions be curious ask them about other players that have helped if you can get in contact with them players ask is it good is he a good agent does he know what he's doing does he have contacts all that stuff so like you need to do your research on them just as much as a legit agent would do research on you so transfer market video cv all that stuff so do research, ask a lot of questions, get them on the phone, see if other people have worked with this agent, other clubs have worked with this agent and see what their experiences were with this guy. Um, but yeah, just like be war, uh, be aware there are a lot of scam, like scam agents out there, fake agents, and 99% of the time they ask for like some upfront fee which they just lie about like um, um, insurance, medical fees, fees to the club, like Never ever does a player have to pay a club to go and train unless it's an open trial. If they've been invited to trial, then there's no fees involved, there's no insurance, there's no medical crap that they think of. They think of all this fake stuff just for you to then give them their upfront fee and then they dash, they go. So just be aware of that. Never ever pay an upfront fee to a club, to an agent, no one. Do your own research, make, make sure he is real, legit, professional. And basically that is it. So yeah, this is what a um, professional trial invitation letter looks like and should look like. It will always look something like this. Simple, quick, professional, clean. Basically, they're the things that matter. So yeah, if you have any more questions about like my pro, my pro trials, agents, letters, clubs, anything like that, drop a comment. I'll see how I can help you guys out. Be sure to drop this video a like and don't forget to subscribe because we're going to be consistent now on the YouTube. This is my third video this week, so... Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Um, have a good night, evening, morning, wherever you are. And I'll see you guys in the next video.